Melbourne Rebels centre Rhys Hodge says the team is leaving no stone unturned to secure its first ever victory in South Africa. Rebels have travelled to the Rainbow Nation to face the Bulls at 11.05pm Australian Eastern Standard Time Saturday night as part of a two-game tour. Despite going into the match off back-to-back -back losses, the Rebels are committed to turning their fortune around, eyeing off a return to the top of the Australian Conference in the Vodafone Super Rugby competition. It's a very important matchup this weekend. Hodge said, two weeks over here in South Africa gives us a chance to get closer as a group and get our historic first win. And hopefully a second one. We will be doing all weekend in our preparation to ensure that we're ready to go. Hodge returns on Saturday after missing last weekend's loss to the Jaguares with a hamstring complaint. The Rebels will, however, be without scrum half Will Genia for the trip, after he injured his hamstring in the same game. But junior Wallabies halfback Harrison Goddard and 27-year-old Michael Ruru are ready to step up in Genia's absence. We have full confidence in both of them, Hodge said. They're capable of not only handling the super rugby level, but excelling at that level. We're pretty excited to see how they go. The Bulls sit second in the South African Conference with a 3-4 record this season, a dangerous opponent with speed to burn out wide. They cause some headaches for defenses, Hodge said. We're going to have our hands full, and it's up to us to really trust in our defense. But, in saying that, we've got some pretty dangerous outside backs ourselves and ones that are very good at defense as well. It's going to be an exciting match. Known for his super boot, sending the ball into orbit despite the aid of the African altitude, Hodge said he is happy to sit behind fly half Jack the Brezeni on the kicking duties. Jack's been kicking great the past few weeks. Hodge said, we all have confidence in him, and there's no reason to change it up.